Well, um, <laughs> I thought that it would only be right for me to come on for this dope discussion there, baby faced, just to show my brothers that, yeah, I get it now. All right. I understand why a lot of you men have been going so hard as far as um, women wearing makeup and women wearing eyelashes and women wearing wigs and weave. I get it now. <laughs> See, with us as women going through all of these extremes to hide who we really and truly and naturally are, it has done nothing but add on to the distrust that a lot of men already have for us. See, let's get into it, you all, all right? And y'all like the video, share the video and subscribe, all right? Because when I show you all this footage that I came across, y'all too will understand where these men are coming from. Y'all too will understand why I had to just go ahead and say, you know what, I'm gonna take it off today, okay? Not like that, but I'm going to take it off today, all right? Men were already dealing with the fact that when it came to our behavior as women, our treatment of men as women, our lifestyles, manipulation tactics that we would utilize on the men, men already had a distrust for us due to those factors alone. But another huge, major factor into all of this distrust is the appearance factor. See, not only were men skeptical about women as far as the way that we treated them, the way that we did a lot of baiting and switching in our actions, but now you mean to tell me that we are also baiting and switching them with our looks? See, I used to think that the men were just being a little bit too hard on us. You know, as a woman that loves to wear makeup and eyelashes and things of that sort myself, you know, I was just like, you know what, fellas, let us live, okay? Let us paint our faces. Let us be able to wear our eyelashes and bring out our cheekbones and our lips and our eyes. Let us live. Y'all doing too much, I thought. But now I get this. Uh -huh, I get this. See, ladies, <clears throat> y'all didn't understand the level of trickery that was being inflicted upon these men. Y'all didn't know what they were dealing with. I didn't either. I didn't know it was this bad. I didn't know it was this extreme. Not until now. <laughs> I understand now why men are like, look, we need to see you naturally. Without the eyelashes, without the makeup, without the weave, without the wig, hell, without the body suits. Are we gonna get into it today? We've been pulling magic tricks on these men. And, and we got the audacity to question them as far as why they want to see us so bad in our natural state. I get it now. I now get why so many men have been so die hard about, look, I need to see what you look like in your natural state. I need to see you without all of the extras. Because the level, like I said, you all, the level of trickery is at an all-time high. I said, no wonder. <laughs> no wonder. No wonder my brothers have been like, oh, Danica, you'll be surprised. They can look real good in the clothes. But outside the clothes, I don't know. You can look real good in the makeup. But outside the makeup, I don't know. You can look real good in the wig but outside the wig i don't know you know and so yeah i used to think that y'all were just doing too much i thought y'all were putting 20 on 10 
Okay, y'all were not. When I share my screen with you all, right? You all will too understand why the men have a very difficult time trusting women in all regards. As far as our ways and actions, our lifestyles, the things that we indulge in, and our appearance. The things that we have been doing to these men, I'm surprised they are not scarred. Or are they? They may be scarred. Y'all think these men just trying to control you and dictate you. And that's why they don't want to see you in the makeup. And that's why they don't want to see you in the wig and the eyelashes and the nails. No. These men are like, look, I, I have got to see you. It's so many fake fraudulent females out here. And it, physically, mentally, emotionally, financially, everything is a fraud. Oh, I thought you was this way, but you that way. I thought you looked this way, but you looked that way. What the hell? It's that bad. And so, yes, as your little big sister, I had got to get on here and show my solidarity. Now, don't get it twisted. I'm still going with my eyelashes. I'm still going with my makeup when I want to. I, I am. That ain't, that ain't going to change. I love to play in makeup. I love to decorate my face, damn it. Okay, that ain't gonna change. But today, <laughs> I say, yeah, I, I gotta let my brothers know, like, I see you. Okay, no pun intended, but I see you, all right? I hope you can see me too. You know, I, I want you all to know that, look, we should not be doing this to you. We should not be out here scarring y'all and tricking y'all like this, adding on to the already of uh, this honest perception that you have of us. Let's share our screen, you all. Now, what we have here is a young lady that seemingly just wanted to doll herself up with a little bit of, I don't know, lipstick, eyeshadow, eyeliner, Maybe a little bit of foundation to smooth out the skin, give a little bit of a glow, right? Nothing too major or extreme or alarming, correct? But, mm -mm. <laughs> mm -mm. it's more to this that meets the eye, okay? It's way more to this than what meets the eye. Um, let's play. I have got to show you better than I can tell y'all. This is why the men don't trust women. Okay? This is why the men don't trust women. Outside of the baiting and switching with your damn attitude and treatment and your manipulation tactics, now they can't trust your appearance. Look... look. <laughs> This is too much. This is too much. This is what the men have been dealing with. That is why the men have been going so hard as far as, oh, enough with the makeup. Enough with the lashes, enough with the wigs, the weeds, enough, enough, enough. This is why these females are performing magic tricks. Okay, this is, I mean, what, what the, it's a whole different person. This woman, or is it, is it a woman? We don't even know. It, it's given a plastic Barbie. It, it's given dried up glue that you peel off your damn hands. 
We don't know. But the men have been dealing with this. This female peeled off her entire face. She didn't wipe it off. She didn't wash it off. She peeled, damn it, her face off. I didn't know that y'all were out here doing this. I didn't know that y'all were being this extreme. No wonder the men don't trust us. Not only can I not trust you to be who you present to be, but I can't even trust you to be who you look to be. What is going on? She peeled her face off. And I'm guessing she put that latex or whatever the hell that was on her, her face to maybe slender out her cheeks. Because it's looking like now she has more puffiness and a roundness to her face. So maybe she put that on to make her not look so big or round. I... Look, this is next level. This is extreme. You thinking, you're thinking as a man that you are signing up to be with this high cheekbone, uh, slender face woman. And she looked like time is the train this is crazy they're peeling their faces off now it should not be a thing to where when you go home at night and you wash your face off you look nothing like you just looked your makeup should be enhancing you not completely transforming you into a different being I mean, I get it now, fellas. I see why y'all don't trust us. I see why y'all don't trust her. Look, she just pulled her whole face off. Pulled it off. Not washed it, not wiped it, not scrubbed it. Pulled it off. Peeled. 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 I said no wonder. But there's more. There's more to this. There is more to back up why these men don't trust us. All right. Let's get into it. Let's let's continue. Unfortunately, there is more. All right. Now, y'all like the video. Share the video and subscribe. We have got to spread this and share this with the world to let everybody know. Like, look, the men were not being too hard on us. The men were not out here just trying to dictate and control every little element of our lives, every little aspect of our lives of us wanting to be, you know, fashionable and creative. No, that's not it. The men have been tricked, bamboozled, leading to them not trusting, leading to them being scarred. Lord have mercy. My hip dips. So you made up your mind. You just wasted my With my BBL shorts. Hold on, because I don't know if y'all caught that. I don't know if y'all caught that. Did she just say she has BBL shorts? This is why men don't trust us. Everything about us fake. Everything about us fake. Peeling the damn face off. Now you mean to tell me y'all buying hips? Now, I don't know if y'all remembered, but back in like March, this is crazy. And look at this. She didn't have no hip and now she got some, Lord. I don't know if y'all remember this, but back in March, they had this thing to where they were promoting these rubber BBL body suits. And we talked about that back in March, right? I believe it was March. And that was crazy, right? These women pulling up pancakes, right? Then next thing you know, they have these wide hips, hourglass shapes, you know, round rear ends because they, they had the rubber BBL bodysuits and it was very much so giving uh, Big Mama's house. 
Is that what the movie was with Martin Lawrence when he was putting on these damn big ass body suits? It was given that. It was given the clumps. You know, with Eddie Murphy. It was given all of that. But now, not only are they hopping into BBL rubber booty body suits, but now they're buying hips. Now they have BBL shorts. These men are being tricked left and right, and y'all are really out here scratching y'all heads, wondering why men don't trust us. When nothing about you is you. Like, how? I just want to know, like, how do you pull this off? How do you get away with this? A man scopes you out like, damn, you got a, she got a nice body, a nice shape. You know, I can't wait to see what that be like. I can't wait to get her outside them clothes. I can't wait to see what that is. And then she removes. Oh, she removes the very thing that attracted you to her in the first place. She removes the hourglass shape. She removes the hips. She removes the booty. She removes the thighs. How do you pull that off, ladies? Like, seriously. No pun intended. I, like, I, I really want to know how do y'all pull that off? Like, all of that extra, you know, bodysuit and, and shorts. And like, that, 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 that's like a lot. But how do you pull it off as far as getting away with, you know, being with a man intimately or whatever the case may be? And, you know, you have to remove your body, like. Let's take it back. Just, just look. Just, just look. She said, filling in my hip dips with my BBL shorts. So if you don't have no hips, don't worry. They have BBL shorts. And y'all wonder why these men go so hard as far as, no, I need my woman to go to the gym. I need my woman to be natural. I need to see what she really looked like. Y'all wonder why. Everything is fake. Look. My hip dips. With my BBL shorts. And when you take them wigs off. <laughs> nah, boo. This is what it is when you take them wigs off. <laughs> oh. 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 Now I know I put this together myself, but this this just caught me off guard again. Like Let's get this straight. Y'all are peeling off your faces. Y'all are sliding on your hips. Now you have the nerve to not have any edges any hair after you just was out here flipping around the wet and wavy now i don't know if y'all peeped that but the brother in the beginning was like you know this is what these women look like without the wig and he had a, a little jacked up little ponytail going on. She said, no, <laughs> actually that would be an upgrade. What we actually look like under the wigs is this. 
Lord have mercy. And y'all wonder why these men don't trust us? Lord have mercy. Let's take it back. Let's take it back. But it is when you take them wigs off. <laughs> nah, boo. This is what it is when you take them wigs off. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Not the sliver of a sideburn and no edges. Not the sliver of the sideburns with no edges. Lord. Lord, not the sliver. Oh. Oh, the rainbow hairline. Oh, not the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Oh, Lord have mercy. I'm sorry, brothers. I, I am. I'm sorry. I, I I didn't know you all were going through this. No wonder y'all were even going so hard on me. Danica, take the lashes off. Take the makeup off. Danica. Y'all probably thought I peeled my face off at night. Y'all probably thought... Ain't no telling what y'all probably thought witnessing what we just witnessed. Lord. Let me ask y'all a question, y'all. All right. Put a one in the chat if you've ever experienced a woman remove a part of herself that you thought was real put a one if you've ever experienced that you took a woman home like oh man she got a nice shape she got a nice body and then she took off her girdle you know she took off the body shaper and then you know the flubber came out um have you ever taken a woman home and you know, you thought that she had some really pretty curly wavy hair and then she put it on the side of the bed. She put it on the dresser. She put it on the nightstand. Y'all let me know. Did you ever think that, you know, you had a woman with pretty uh, brown hazel eyes that changed colors and then all of a sudden she removed them and put them into the contact jar? Y'all let me know. Is, is this what you all are out here experiencing? Have you ever taken the woman home and, and thought that she looked like a Holly Berry, Holly Berry in the face? And then she started to wipe the makeup off or peel the damn makeup off. And it was given, I don't know, uh, Forrest Whitaker. Y'all let us know. Put a one if you've experienced that. If you have, again, I'm sorry. Because we're supposed to at least look like somewhat of who we are when we take off our makeup. Our hair is supposed to at least be intact up under the damn wigs. You know, uh, our bodies should at least look like what it looks like in the damn dress. I mean... Again, I'm sorry, but I, I need to know. I have got to know what y'all have experienced out there because I didn't know that you all were being traumatized like this. No wonder you don't trust us. All right. And once y'all do place y'all ones in the chat, I need you to go into detail as far as, you know, what you were tricked by. I would love to know so that we can stop this. We, we have got to put an end to this. This is craziness. This is craziness. Look, y'all. I just had to come on here and let you all know that I get it now. Um, and yes, I'm still going to wear my makeup and my eyelashes. But, you know, I had to let y'all know today. Yeah. 
We we in solidarity today. Okay. We stand together as a family today, as far as you know, the natural, you know, as far as you know, taking it off. All right, we, we look, hold on. Because this right here, <laughs> next level. This is next level. But yeah, y'all like this video, share this video and subscribe. Share it with all the women all over the world so they can understand, you know, what's going on. Men are not out here not trusting us for no reason. We're giving them, you know, major reasons not to trust us. All right, ladies, we have got to do better. Start taking care of your natural self before you start putting extra stuff on it. Instead of, you know, covering up the rolls, go to the gym. Do some hip rolls, you know, that's going to get you tight. That's going to get you in shape. Instead of, you know, plastering on the damn latex and makeup and stuff, you know, exfoliate. Wash your face, you know, do the, the oils, do the lotions, do what you need to do. Take care of your natural self first. You should not be removing things and then you're removing you. No, 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 no. You, come on. Come on, take care of your edges. Your wig should not be in better shape than your natural hair. This this is just out. This is this is outrageous. I I'll see y'all later. All right. And again, fellas, I'm sorry. Okay. I I, I really am sorry. I I am. Um. This should have not ever been a thing. I, I didn't know it was this extreme. And yeah, as a woman that loves makeup and lashes and stuff of that sort myself, yeah, I didn't know it was this bad. So yeah, um, ladies, no words, just peace y'all.